Hello and welcome to another episode of Invisible Gamer Plays. I'm Tristan. And I'm Dan. And we're playing Super Smash Brothers for Wii U again. Because we're going to be playing this game on Fridays, pretty much. Which is a pretty good schedule, so. Yeah, and eventually it might become other multiplayer games, but for now, Smash Bros. is too good. Um, we're playing... So every week we're going to try to come up with some like cool little uh, premise for that week. Last week we just played like how we usually play with our mains and, and kind of playing semi-seriously. Now we're playing uh, all random characters, all random stages, and low items. Just because we got to have something help us out with. <laughs> we're just trying to find like ways to like you know mix it up. Right. Just the different. Um, there. The thing that I love about Smash Brothers is that there's so many different ways to play this exactly, game. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Um, and uh, so yeah, we're playing. I'm Pit. Right, Dark Pit, actually. And I'm Yoshi. Yeah. And we're we're Which, just it out. I've never played as Dark Pit before, so. He's pretty um, much the same thing as Pit. Right. The only thing that's different is uh, his side B. Side B, right. Um, it just has like electric properties, I think, or probably does more damage. Yeah, and it's a totally different like, little doodad. Well, in moveset wise, okay. though, because there is like stats that are different, and that's actually different. I was gonna say I don't know his final smash is. That's pretty much Sheik's final smash and Zelda's final. Smash. Oh yeah, yeah, like the, the arrow. Um. Yeah, no, Smash Bros. definitely has. It's, it's got tons of modes, and you know that's just how it how it's been since the start. I would even say, even though you know, 64 one didn't really. I think this is a Pokemon stage. It has to be. No, yeah, it's we've, a Pokemon we've, stage. We've, we've talked about this. About this for I'm like, such a well, long the thing time. that throws me off is like the weird church thing, but I think it's from one of the newer it's games. It's probably like a uh, like a kind of Final Four, Elite like Four, Elite Four, like you, you know, yeah. like where you fight, right? Like some certain type of gym, like or like maybe it's a bonus thing in a certain game that like yeah, after you beat the Elite Four, it's like the yeah, Pokemon kind of like tower, how, Battle Tower or whatever. Kind of like how you go to a different region in like uh, Heart Gold and Soul Silver, right. and a lot of other games. Would that's the only game I have played in the Pokemon series, but... Yeah, uh, I reviewed Omega Ruby, which is like the latest generation I've played. Um, both in terms of remakes, because that's technically a Gen 6 game, but also the original games, the Gen 3 games, are the latest ones i played. So in terms of Pokemon, that's the actual Pokemon themselves, that's the one I'm most familiar with. Or, not most familiar with, but, you know, most recently familiar yeah. with, <laughs> yeah. is Gen 3. So I'm kind of behind on my Pokemon stuff too, so I'm not really aware of what's going on in this so. But like like that giant dragon thing doesn't necessarily look like a Pokemon thing, that's why I'm like, what? But I guess it's just a dragon Pokemon because I think all the ones that spawn right there are dragon types. That are like standing right there. Oh shoot, I oh god. I hate this final smash. <laughs> it's actually not shoot. as bad um I think they buffed it in this game actually. Oh really? Great, that's just been I've never known how to breathe the uh... The, like different type of fire, like not just the fireball, but just kind of like the. Uh... You can do that. A different type of fire. Also, yeah. this item is really real cheap. Yeah. It's... I don't. How do you get out of there? Oh crap! I paused <laughs> it, trying to like mash different buttons. Yeah. How do you even there. get out of I there? I do not know. That's There's pretty, uh, uh... that and what's that one item from Zelda? Like this, it's from Skyward Sword. They have it and it like brings you up. It's kind of like the same thing. Um... It like you know brings you high up Oh, on the, the beetle thing? Yeah, the beetle thing. Does that take you up? Yeah, Lord? it takes oh. you up. Like, it attaches you. Like, it attaches to you just like that. Um, maybe it's, like, easier to get out of or something? I don't oh, know I don't if you deal with that is, but... Yeah, I, I'm not as familiar with this game as I might be. But I've been playing a lot. Last time, our first episode, we hadn't unlocked everything. Now we have every character in stage unlocked. Well, um, the only character we didn't have was Rob last right, time. Right, right, right. We were missing a few, quite a few stages, but now we have everything unlocked. Except for like, you know, all the... Wait a second, what sure. are we? Are we metal? metal? Yeah. I was like, wait a second, it looks like metal, but it kind of looks... Yeah, it's a little like more Like the coloring shiny. of the stage yeah. kind of makes it look like a... Like a little darker, I guess. Like, I don't know, like in color. And you beat me too. Yeah. So that's... I think I'm liking Pit. I like Pit in this game. You're really good as Pit in this game. Or maybe it's just Pit is good in this yeah. game. I, it might be just. It, it could be good. both. Also, that just right. said Ka uh, Kalos Pokemon League. Kalos is the most recent, re most recent region. So, so that must be. Like, yeah, it's the, the final. F uh, you got me saying final four like it's some kind of. <laughs> I think that's uh, a college basketball. I deal. think that's a thing from Beautiful Joe. Like there's a like a boss stage that was called the Final Four. Oh well, and it's also the isn't that a college basketball thing? Uh, I think so. Speaking Probably of Rob, we were saying it. earlier we unlocked Rob. Now I'm playing as him. Uh, this wouldn't have been possible without I, I, I'm kind of surprised that Rob's in this game again. 
But yeah, uh, me too. Because it was but kind I'm of happy. Weird... I'm happy that he is because yeah, he was cool. kind of uh, like I didn't necessarily main him, but I liked playing as him a lot. He was one of your one of your main characters. Or yeah. One of the ones you like playing as. Yeah. Uh, I wonder. I wonder if that side B attack still projects. Uh, Re reflects projectiles. Oh, I have no idea. Oh, it just bounced off me though. Oh, because I have the uh, Franklin badge, right? That's what it's called. Yeah, from Earthbound. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I forgot what I was going to say about something. Oh, I was going to say, Rob, it was like a weird thing that he, like, out of nowhere, was in Mario Kart DS, right? Yeah, it was in DS. And then he was in Smash Bros, and he had, like, he was just around all of a sudden. And, and yeah, it's kind of weird. Games. And, uh, it, like, I don't know, like, why, why they that decided was. <laughs> to just, like, well, maybe randomly that... promote, like, you know, Rob from the NES days. Well, maybe because at that point, like, it had been long enough since anything had ever referenced Rob, which I think the last actually, time before that was just Rob himself when he was around. Actually not. Well, I mean, maybe, like, small little references. Yeah, that I'm, I'm not that I'm missing, like but... like in, uh, I think it was... Kirby's Dream Land 3, Rob was in it. Like, you had oh, to collect really? pieces of Rob in a stage, and, like, he would come and he would, like, give you, like, a piece to a star or something. Huh. Well, at and least that's, it's playable. Kind of like a, He's never... Well, he yeah. was never even playable in his own games. That You didn't play as Rob. You just... He was like, a controller. Like, played with Rob. Yeah. Yeah. But he, he still... Yeah. So, I don't know. It, it definitely was... It had been a long time, though, regardless. Uh, I think it's just because they realized, oh, cool, it's been, like, 20 years or whatever. Now we can kind of... Uh, Catalyze that nostalgia, which Nintendo does a lot. Yeah. Not that that's I mean, a bad that thing is... or a good thing, it's just that is a thing that they do. They capitalize on their nostalgia for sure. That's what this entire game is. Exactly, it's just a celebration of uh, the Nintendo. recent years that Nintendo has had with their games. Uh, wow, we both died. <laughs> <laughs> I went down to spike you, but that was a fail, so. Shoot! Ah, oh, you almost got the Dragoon piece! Man, this is pretty intense, actually. Because now we're tied. I'm actually learning how to dodge a little bit more. I, usually, when I get back to playing Smash Bros. again, because I, I get little phases of playing Smash, it takes me a while to get back into the habit of dodging. I never get into the habit of grabbing, which I'm actually trying to do right now. <laughs> that was a cool little <laughs> maneuver right there. Oh my god. Have to you have to focus so much? Oh, damn! Yeah. Damn, oh, yeah. that's final stats though. I think you're gonna get me. Yep. So we're tied for this video. Oh, uh, this is intense. You won this the is really good. Yeah, you won. We keep doing is... best two out of three tiebreakers basically. Um, you yeah. won the first episode. We're gonna. I think we're gonna keep track in general of our. Of our wins yeah, and losses. Of our multiplayer or Friday wins and losses, including yeah. other games. So, currently you're the final right, battle. Let's do it. So, currently you're in the lead because you won the first episode. So whoever wins this gets another point on the scoreboard. It. And then yeah, if I win, yeah, that's all right. Mar Mars side B it was um, kind of taken down a peg in this game. <laughs> you're playing as King DDD. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Okay, I remember um, I played against a level two Lucario. We had a tournament once, and I had to play as King DDD. And I lost to a level 2 Lucario. That's how good you are at King DDD. I'm actually kind of good at King DDD, because I remember beating you once with him, and you're you're way better at Smash than me. Don't, don't <laughs> uh, believe the, the win I just had, but... Uh, and I beat you with King DDD, and I remember being so happy. Because <laughs> King DDD is such a dumb character. He's like, he is. No, he's... I don't know what it is. But there's something kind of... Likeable. Uh, I like King Dedede as a character in general because he's like a penguin, and the penguins are cool. He's like a he's a big fat penguin, which is awesome. Yeah, uh, it's awesome. But no, as a, as a Smash character, he's pretty. He's pretty I bad, mean, I think the reason why you know he was in Brawl and the other game, uh, other game meaning this game, yeah. um, was Sakurai just wanted like more representation from the Kirby from series. Kirby, yeah, because it's, it's something that and, he did. Yeah. I mean, he also did that with Meta Knight, making him, like, the best character Well, I don't know. I mean, you can't really speak to that. that that's true. Like, you know, maybe that's... Because it's not just he makes the entire game, you know? There's a yeah, whole it's team. not only him. There's a whole team true. that works in the game, so the balancing and stuff might have been someone else. Dang. She really gets you. 
WarioWare is really weird. I think we should maybe play that sometime. If we, I don't actually yeah, I don't I own a cool. Wario game, player game. I used to play Twisted a lot in a friend's house. That wait, tw wait, which was the one that we won? That's Twisted, right? Um, isn't it WarioWare Smooth Moves? Yes, that's it. You're right. Smooth Moves is the we won. That was a really fun one, and that's really the only experience I had with WarioWare actually. Did I knock that and, out of you? Yes, and you were destroying me. Shoot. Oh man, you might be able to get me though. Oh man, okay. Mm -hmm. I don't want to be seen by uh. They changed his, they changed his side B, which I'm kinda sad about that. Shoot. Wait, what is this is way different, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Before he like Before called all his minions and he stuff. He called all the minions and there's a meme about it called the big gay dance. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> It was really funny. The big, wait, gay dance? The big gay dance. Oh. Like, yeah. Oh, because he's like really flamboyant in it? Oh god, what is it? Wait, why am I invincible? What? Or invisible. What? Oh, it's what? Uh, Skull Kid's doing that. Okay, is that me? <laughs> I'm just messing with the stage, I guess. Oh man, that, that's got a big area of effect when you land. Yeah. Oh, I got. I thought I was safe, and then I got hit. This is real close. I dare you to do it. Oh, you can cancel it in midair. Yeah, but you can. Oh my god. We're gonna get seen. We're both gonna be seen. Oh, oh. oh. oh no! <laughs> oh, that was, so, that was close. so close. We both. Oh man, you won as King DDD. Oh. <laughs> so Dan's two zero. Dan's the winner. Wow. Of our, our multiplayer I'm, Friday you know, videos. I'm really surprised that I won with Kid DDD. I've like never won a match with him before. Well, it was always a first. Yes. And of course, it had to happen to me. <laughs> Yay. That was that was good.